SHS is home for pets in between homes, but those days tend to be longer for older cats and dogs. Today we are trying to find Ziggy a home. The Nebraska Humane Society is meant to be temporary housing for animals who are looking for their permanent homes. But the length of state really can vary. Puppies and kittens fly out of here, while sometimes older animals or animals with medical conditions take a bit longer to find their forever homes. Today, we'd like to introduce you to a cat that's been here simply because he's had a run of bad luck. This is Ziggy. He came into the shelter because his owners ran into financial trouble and couldn't keep him. They were very unhappy to have to give him up because they reported he's a great cat. He does get stressed around other cats, and here there are lots of cats. So Ziggy got stressed and got sick with a cat cold. He's been treated with antibiotics and he's fine, but that treatment added days onto his stay. Ziggy has actually been here since December. At 12, he's mature, likes catnip and scratching posts, but apparently didn't scratch the furniture. Since he's stressed with visiting cats and dogs, he'd be best as the only pet. Toddlers also cause him to hide, so older children and a quieter home would be the perfect match. He's a dashing tuxedo boy with a quirky crooked tail and a lazy meow. If you're looking for a true companion who just wants to be around you, maybe sit on your lap and keep you warm during this frigid weather, well that is Ziggy's M.O. Well this handsome man is a senior sweetheart, so his adoption fee is just $10. We're hoping that Ziggy finds someone who will match up with well, so he can find his forever home and be the cat we all know he can be. Right Ziggs? For the Nebraska Humane Society, I'm Pam Weiss. Our producer says she'll take him. The Nebraska Humane Society is at 8929 Fort Street. Today and tomorrow, it's open from 10 until 5, Monday through Friday from 9 until 7. Remember, you can always look up animals and find information at nehumanesociety.org.